this is our robot, and this is their docking station. I'm just gonna hit the home button there to just get the screen on. Miss Jasmine, the Linda Mood Bell coach, is the one that um, we're working with today. We've worked with a couple other ones, um, but she should pop up here on the screen in just a second. Oh, hi. In the training, I learned more about the symbol imagery and concept imagery and how we can imprint these letters or sounds or whatever the program is into their brain so they can retain it. That is what has really been a biggest difference is the ability that they say it, hear it, then they are seeing it and picturing it in their mind and their, their biggest thing is if you can picture it, then you can retain it and keep it forever. So the amazing difference between seeing it and it's not like just showing either, you have to also take the picture away so they're picturing it in their minds and then being able to correlate it with their um, air writing, with their fingers or um, table writing, um, whichever, whatever's the right level for that student. Yeah. Really nice. See, see, what? Yeah. Oh, that is supposed to be hard. That was so easy. The other part about the Linda Mood Bell is the energy it creates and helps keep going is when a student responds to a question, then we spot and point out the positive. The only way we are helping to support that student, the second step, is questioning them to be able to figure out what it was that was the difference between what the question was and what their answer was. And it's amazing to see how the student, when you've pointed that positive and then asked the questions, how much they try to keep figuring out the correct word or the correct answer. And sometimes, of course, if a child is still not, you know, being able to get it correctly because of the questioning, then it's just a positive tell. Actually, this is the letter this. But the fact that it's so positive and it just keeps the energy going, um, it's magical to see the student not be like, oh, I missed it but they're, they just keep at it trying to find that, they're so motivated to find the right answer. Okay. What word is that? You got One of my responsibilities is to ensure that we're providing individualized instruction based on the needs of our students. One of the ways that we've been able to accomplish that this year is through our partnership with Linda Mood Bell. Through Linda Mood Bell, we purchased two new reading programs, both of which use symbol imagery in order to increase phonological awareness or help students better understand the sounds associated with words as well as increase comprehension for our students. One of the greatest added benefits of working with Linda Bell is that we've been able to provide live and ongoing instruction in the classroom for our students and teachers with the Linda Bell coaches who specialize in these programs through the robots that have been provided for us. The kids are really excited with the robot. They look forward to having it come in. You know, it's really interesting for them. It's fun, it's exciting. But also, Jasmine, uh, the consultant behind the robot, has a great personality. So she really interacts with the kids. She knows their names. They feel special. They feel like they're getting something really neat and unique. Um, it's been a great experience. For me, it's great because uh, Jasmine comes in, the consultant comes in, and she's an expert. I had never done seeing stars or the visualizing and verbalizing before this year, so it's all been new. So having her there to kind of help guide, give me suggestions and ideas, but also model what she's doing. I get great ideas as far as language, also um, where when to push my kids, where to push my kids. It's been really helpful for me. Uh, it's been really helpful. You know, it's another tool in my toolbox. It um, There's different levels of seeing stars. It's kind of more the decoding and, and reading words. 
and then there's visualizing verbalizing which is more for comprehension that has been really really nice some of my kiddos can decode fine they don't need necessarily need help but they really struggle in comprehension and then I can turn to visualizing and verbalizing uh, with other kids comprehension isn't an issue but decoding is and then I can work with seeing stars it's been really good especially for those who've had trouble and other tools haven't worked in the past I've been seeing results with seeing stars oh. Oh, oh, I knew that. I knew that. <laughs>